Okay, hi, this is Ethan Leeds from Empower the Body to Fight Cancer Naturally, and I've just uh, been having a chat with my friend Skylar, who was diagnosed um, some time ago, I'm not sure how long ago it was now, maybe he'll, he can tell us, but some time ago uh, with cancer, and he was told he was somewhere between stage three and four, and he's been following a natural protocol, and he's doing, you know, he's doing pretty decent, but he was just telling me how he goes through detox um, as part of his protocol, and it's pretty unpleasant as anyone that's been through detox knows and, and he was just explaining what recently happened when he took some seed nutrition products um, which he recently started and what happened with the detox so I'm just gonna pass over to Skylar so hi Skylar hey how are you doing I'm um, good so can you just share Skylar what you were just telling me um, about soul and core and how how they worked in your situation with detox yes I, I am I got diagnosed about six months ago um, I'm beating it. My, my, my score is going down and I recently added in the, 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 the soul, I added the soul seeds in there soul, right. and I thought it was a great product and everything. And then I realized that I should have got the core with it. So I reordered the soul and I reordered the core together, which has all those greens and I got it sitting in there on the, on my counter and I started going through a detox. And what a detox is, is when your body gets filled up with dead cancer cells or whatever else is in there and your body needs to get rid of it. So it's trying to dump it. And what it really feels like, it feels like I have the flu, feels like I have a fever. Even though I might not have a fever, I feel hot, but I could put a thermostat in and I don't really have a fever. So there's something definitely going on in the body that's doing that to expel it. But I feel wore down. I feel like I had the flu. And so I'm sitting there and I take a, a core and a soul seeds together at the same time. Okay. And in five, five minutes, my pain went away. Incredible. I'm like, I was going unbelievable. I understand this. Every month, every four weeks to six weeks, I'll go through a detox where I start expelling the cancer. Okay. And that's when I go through it through, and I have that pain. So for about a week, five days to maybe seven days, you know, I don't take any of my vitamins, minerals and all that. I just take my, my baking soda to help keep my pH up. And I, I take products like drinking the green juice and things like that, but I lay off the pills and the minerals and man, I just could not believe it. I'm talking to you right now on day three. Okay. Day one, I was in pain. Day two, I was out of pain and day three, I'm out of pain right now. You know, and normally I'm so miserable that I don't even want to get off the couch, but I could not believe what the product did and how much pain it took away. Listen, I, I can only tell you, I have cancer and I'm going to beat this cancer. Sorry for the teeth that are out. I had to get my crowns pulled. Um, but I haven't, I haven't looked this skinny in a long time. I was about 205 and now I'm about 150. So um, it's been a fight. It's been a lot of work and I'm not going to quit. And I just want to let everyone know that, you know, you should get this product. If you're, if you're, if you're sick and it did what it just did. Oh my gosh. It, it's incredible. So it's incredible. Awesome. Well, Skylar, I really appreciate you sharing that. I hope, I hope that people get to hear this and, and realize that, you know, natural things can have very, very powerful effects. And certainly for me, soul and core are incredibly powerful um, healing properties that, that, that help so many people. And it's great to, to hear people like yourself that have got personal experience. So thank you very much for that. Yeah, we'll be, we'll definitely be stocking up on a lot of this and heading back to Costa Rica. Awesome. Thanks. Thanks. All the good, good vegetables and fruits that don't have Monsanto and contaminated stuff in it. You know what I mean? I know what you're saying. So, so you're, in the, you're in the U.S. right now, I'm, I'm assuming, right? Yeah. yeah, I'm in the U.S. right now. I'll be here for a little bit. Um, just being here, I just, it's like I, I went into to Whole Foods today or the other day and I, I bought all these organic eggs and I could squish them and break them with my two fingers. And I'm just like, man, you can't trust anyone here. You know, it's just like, yeah, it's not always what it seems. Okay. I'm going to end the recording now. We can carry on chatting, Skylar, but I'm just going to end this now for everybody else. So just one second.